Hello, everyone. Uh, I will briefly discuss uh, our new results, constraint hiding, constraint PRFs for any circuit from standard lattice assumptions. This is a joint work with Chris Pikert. So first, let's uh, re recall the definition of the constraint hiding, constraint PRF. Uh, a constraint hiding, constraint PRF is a normal PRF uh, which uh, has this nice uh, property. Given a circuit C, we can produce, by V I mean anyone who holds the secret key for the PRF, we can produce a constrained version of the PRF. And what does that mean? That means that uh, this constrained version of the PRF satisfies all these three properties informally. So as long as uh, uh, the circuit C, uh, so uh, as long as uh, the, the input to the, uh, P, uh, uh, the input X, as long as C of X is zero, the value of the constraint PRF and the uh, true value of the PRF match. But if uh, the C of X is one, then the constraint version of the PRF reveals nothing about the true value of the PRF. And furthermore, the constraint version of the PRF uh, hides the circuit C. Now, uh, in, uh, in PKT 17, 2017, Bonnet, Levy, and Wu uh, defined the notion of uh, defined uh, constraint hiding constraint PRF and gave a, constru a construction using, based on uh, indistinguishability obfuscation. Later in uh, Eurocrypt 2017, uh, Bonnet, Kim, and Montgomery uh, gave a construction uh, which supported the secret class of e equality check circuits. And in the same conference, Canetti and Chen uh, gave a construction for NC1 circuits, circuits with logarithmic depth. Both of, both of these two constructions were based on standard lattice assumptions. In our work, we give a lattice-based construction which supports uh, basically all polynomial size circuits. As a bonus, we also um, construct lattice-based private programmable PRFs and what is a pro private programmable PRF? Uh, if you attended this morning's talk, then you would remember that it's a constraint hiding, constraint hiding, constraint PRF for the circuit class of equality check circuits, which uh, allows us to program the value of the PRF at the constraint point. So let's uh, have a high level, uh, brief high level overview of our techniques. Our core technique is a way to secretly embed any function G, and by any function G, in particular, I mean function G that are independent of the PRF inside the, uh, so we can uh, hide any function G inside the constraint PRF, such that if we evaluate the constraint PRF, the, uh, the value equals the true value of the PRF plus the value, of, uh, the, uh, the value of G evaluated at that, uh, at that point. So with this technique, now uh, it is easy to, uh, no, with this technique, we uh, set G to be C times auxiliary, an auxiliary PRF. And this auxiliary PRF can be any PRF based on any assumption. It's independent of the PRF we are, the PRF we are constructing. And with, the, uh, with this G that we defined, it's not hard to see why we are now having a constraint hiding constraint PRF. When C of X equals zero, uh, then G also equals zero, so the, value, the true value and the constraint value match. But when uh, C equals one, then G, the value of G equals the value of the auxiliary PRF, and that completely hides the true value of the PRF. That was it. Thank you.